Hello and welcome to my let's play of Minecraft Dungeons, which is Mojang Studios' newest game. And today we're going to be taking a look at the Redstone Mines, potentially playing it on default 6 because I'm feeling like a like this maybe. Actually, I've seen Redstone Mines. I know what it's like. So let's go default 5. Let's go. Let's start the mission, continuing with the story. And something else I know is if if you get hit by the minecarts, you get hurt. So got to be what got to be watching out for that one. Let's watch the cutscene then. There are unsettling rumblings in the mountains of the overworld. Whispered rumours say the Illagers are building something dreadful far beneath these ancient mines. Something of soot, metal and flame. Only a hero such as yourself could brave the cavernous underground and uncover the truth. Lovely then. Uh, okay. Let's locate these villagers. How many secrets? Zero secrets, but nine chests. Okay, so we don't have to do many secret hunting, secrets hunting. But what we do have to do is looking for chests. Now, I'm not sure how much damage these minecarts actually do. Let's see. Uh, 81. Wow. Wow. That's a fair amount, actually. Oh my god, I keep getting hit by the minecarts. Anything down here? Can you tell me, lads? Oh god. Alright. Gotta be very careful about this. Let's eat my death cap. And let's wallop those guys. Alright, what do we got? Rapid crossbow, whatever that is. So how many chests have we got now? Four. Just from going down that little passage. That's pretty good if you ask me. Supplies. What are you? Oh, there's a villager. I'm trying to free you, but... Okay, there's three villagers and they're all that way. Probably shouldn't have used my potion that soon. Oh god, this is bad. I don't want to die. Alright, nice. Got the potion. This villager is the only one left. Okay. We got him. We got him. What is this way? Lots of mobs, of course. What else? Ooh, pig. What we got? Diamond pickaxe. Ooh. It's worse than what I've got, though. It's worse than what I've got now. It's worse than my soul knife. That's a bit... A bit crazy. Well, at least we got another unique weapon. Looks like we got some TNT which we can use in a bit. Yeah, we're definitely going to want to use that TNT now. Got him. Alright, let's fight our way through here and free those villagers. You there. Oh, I didn't realise how low I was. That could have been potentially catastrophic. Free this guy. Looks like there's six villagers we have to free. There's another one here. And another one down there, apparently. Hello there. Alright. We got all of those guys now. So what we might want to do is run down to this gate, because I think that's where we need to go next. Yeah.
have a feeling there may be a boss fight coming up now. So, I think what I'm going to do is... Oh, God. Oh, God. Yep, okay. We've got a boss, a.k.a. Mr. This Guy, Redstone Golem. Oh, God. Okay, okay. 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 Run away. Let's just do some very fancy moves here. Because we have what I'd like to call an actual hard boss mob here. We don't want to step in whatever those little fizzy things are. Oh, okay, apparently that doesn't work on him. Go! We don't want to step in the fizzy things. Whatever we do. The fizzy things hurt a lot. And I'm guessing we don't want to step in the lava either. Oh god. Oh! Oh! My god, okay. We were so weak. But we did it. We did it. That's not the end, though. We still gotta leave the mine. We did it. The villagers are building a dreadful forge under the mountain. Let's hope I get something that I haven't got yet. Probably not, I'm guessing. Oh! Right, so this is a corrupted beacon. And I've heard about these, right? I don't know really what to replace it with. But it requires souls as well. Let's try and showcase it. Right after we do our daily trade. We've got a soul cross... Oh! Okay, that's good. We have officially got our power level up to above 40. Alright, let's pop our Corrupted Beacon there. I'm not sure if that's what I want to replace because it's quite good. Um, tasty bone. No thanks. Uh, I'll salvage you. Now, I forgot to mention up until now, I can actually equip a baby chicken pet. So this little guy can follow me around everywhere. Very cute. We want to kill as many of these as possible. Because every time I kill something with either my crossbow... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Never mind. Anytime I kill something with my crossbow... Or my soul knife... I get something called souls. And souls... Can be used by special artifacts to do things like this. So thank you very much for watching this episode of the Let's Play. We will be obviously jumping straight into Desert Temple. I see we've unlocked Fiery Forge now, which is exciting. We're getting quite close to the Obsidian Pinnacle over here. Oh, and looks like it officially shows us what that is now. I know what that is, but I'm not going to say. That's our ultimate destination. So I'm very excited to get cracking really into the kind of ending of this game. It's going to get really great. So stick around. Thank you very much for watching this episode, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Thank you.